Hello everyone and welcome back to 50 plus luxury style. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today's video is a shoe haul. I'm excited to share with you four pairs of shoes that I've purchased in the past, I would say four weeks. Three of them I've already worn, so they were reveal. One of them is a true unboxing. I received it in the mail about a week ago, have not had a chance to open it, and I'm gonna share it today with you. We are going to go ahead and get started with the first one is a pair of Louis Vuitton loafers. Here they are. I don't have a box for these. I do have the dust bags, but these I purchased in the Louis Vuitton store in the South Coast Plaza Mall. What a beautiful, beautiful store they have. And I was traveling from California to Vegas and then Florida. So I just left the box. It's this really, really pretty black calf leather loafer. And in the front, it just has some gold tone hardware that has the Louis Vuitton surrounded by this circle. And they are made in Italy. Like I said, I've already worn them. They are very, very comfortable. And I foresee that I will get a lot of use from these. These are good for work or if you want to really wear them with some jeans, casual. And yep, yeah, this is my first pair of shoes that I picked up within the last month. By the way, if you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'd appreciate if you could click that subscribe button down below. It's free for you, but it really helps me. So I would appreciate it. And now let's get back into the shoe haul. Number two shoe. It is a Christian Louboutin. I purchased this one right before I went away on my travel, did I? Yes. And was looking for a particular pair. They did not have them, but these were on sale. And I thought, why not? And they are, give me a second here. These right here, these are called the Cornell. I think that's how you say it. It's Cornell or Cornelli. And they are black patent leather. They have 85 millimeter heels, which is what I was looking for. I really did not want to get the 100 or the 105s. They have this very pretty asymmetrical cut in the front, they have a pointy toe. And again, the red bottoms. I did wear them once already. And I bought these true to size. I'm a 37 in all of my shoes. I'm a 37 in Louis Vuittons and I'm actually a 37 in the Christian Louis Vuittons also. So these are the ones that I got. They are very comfortable. And I'm very excited to have them. This is just a black pump that you can use for just about anything. The heel is high enough to be elegant, but in my opinion, low enough that you're not going to be killing your feet like you usually do with the 105s. These did come with the dust bags and also the additional uh, little replacement heels. And that was that. Well, one thing that you will notice is the first three pairs of shoes, they're all black. Wasn't planned that way, but that's how it happened. My next pair is from Chanel. I Here's the bag, which I have to get rid of. I did travel with this bag from Vegas to Florida. This particular style is a classic. I already own a pair in a different colorway and I have been trying to purchase this particular color for one year. I was trying really to get it at Nordstrom. They're just never available in my size. I tried in other, in Saks, couldn't find it available in my size. 
and finally was able to get them at the boutique in the Chanel, was it in the Win? I think it was the Chanel in the Win. And excited I was finally able to get them. Let me share. And came with a dust bag. And they are the slingbacks. They are the all black slingbacks. I love these shoes. I find them to be very, very comfortable. They are all in goat skin leather with the grow green toe pump. It has a little CC on the side of the heel. And these are 2.6 inch heels, I believe. I've already worn this pair also, and I love these for work. When I don't wanna wear a heel, this still gives you a little bit of height, but they're very, very comfortable. I also have them in the beige and black combination, and I absolutely love these. So these are my third pair of shoes that I picked up in the past month. And now we're gonna go ahead and do the true unboxing. I bought these also at the South Coast Plaza store. They had to order the size for me because they did not have it in store. I'm excited. So let's, let's see. Hmm. Let me see. Okay, yeah, it's the regular shoe box which slides out. Not easily though. Inside we have one and two dust bags. And oh, let me get them both out so that I can show them to you. Any guesses what these could be? Make sure they got the right size and they did and these are the louis vuitton sparkle mules and they are sparkly indeed these are made of they have a leather outsole and then they have satin and straws they have a 3.7 inch heel let me just show you the details up front this is what it looks like. Very, very sparkly for those of us that enjoy the sparkle. The heel has all of the sparkle and then it has the LV initial at the bottom. And I thought these were so pretty for an evening out that I, as soon as I saw them, I fell in love with them. They actually have them in this gold color and they also have them in silver in case you're interested. I'll be sure to link them down below if you're interested in checking them out on the LV site. And this is what they look like. And that is my shoe haul, four pairs of shoes. I. There's one or two that I'm interested in getting in, but I think let's put a halt for shoes for now. Um, if you have any questions on the shoes or if you're interested in seeing what my luxury shoe collection looks like, let me know in the comments down below. And other than that, take care and I will see you soon. Bye.